Hey, howdy. Hello. I'm Pat from Pat David Music, and I'm Ryan, and I'm Angela from RNA Music. And at the moment, we are all in Canton, deep That's in the heart of Texas. Deep That's in right. the heart of Texas. Oh my, my flag's gone. So. <laughs> This should be fun. This is going to be interesting. I'm excited. Yeah. yeah. I'm excited. Well, so you may have seen the video that we did before uh, where I was saying <laughs> Texas and some southern sayings as well. And yes. that was a lot of fun. So hopefully I didn't offend anyone. Like what? Uh, fitting to stomp someone's mud hole. <laughs> so that had no it's, accent uh, whatsoever. Fixing to stomp, stomp you a new mud fitting hole. Fitting to go to Walmart. Yeah. It's good. It's good. I'm learning. It's getting there. I'm yeah, trying. We're working on it. You're I'm doing trying. great, though. But thank you. Um, but today, what we thought we'd do, and it's so good, we had so many people um, that commented. We, we both sort of made statuses on our Facebook pages yes. and said, hey, uh, you know, Ryan said, if you have any Texas sayings that you want Pat to say, let us know. And I said, if you have any really famous Australian sayings, because I couldn't think any, of any off the top of my head. And yeah. now there was a barrage on both of us. So Yay, internet. Yeah. <laughs> Yay, Facebook. Yes. So Thank anyway, so, so there's so many people um, that commented on both of us, and so we had some hilarious sayings. I think that, that's, <laughs> some sayings that maybe the three of us hadn't heard before. Yeah. So we had some really hilarious sayings. I think that, that's, some sayings that maybe the three of us hadn't heard before. Yeah. In both our native tongues. But uh, it, was, it was really funny. So today we're doing some old Australian slangs. Uh, now I'll say maybe whether this is like current or maybe this is something that you'll never like, hear. Is this a real thing or are your Australian fans just want to make us look Well, a lot of them, you won't actually understand what they are. So right. I'll, I'll have to explain them. Okay. And okay. some of them, I'll probably explain wrong. So this will they, be... let me know because some of them I haven't heard in such a long time. That sounds so, good. Yeah. yeah. This will be an educational video. Yeah, it is. Well, that's how we like to keep our channels, yeah? Mm. Education. Okay, right. something new every day. That's so, right. the first one. Okay. Dead horse. Dead horse. Dead horse. Yeah. Dead horse, but horse. Horse. Dead horse. Right? Okay. So, That's sounds true. very much like tomato sauce. Can I hear it in a sentence, please? <laughs> yeah. Well, sounds very much like tomato sauce because that's what the nickname is. So, it's tomato sauce. Will you pass the dead horse? Tomato okay. sauce. Okay. Very old country slang. Okay. Dead horse. Yeah. Will you pass the dead horse? Yeah. Yeah. Dead horse. Yeah, nice, nice. We passed the tomato sauce. Thank you. Nice translation. We okay. got sauce today. Hit the frog and toad. See, now this one's really British, so I don't think this one's Australian. Hit the frog and toad. No, I can't. No. Jess suggested this. Jess, I don't know if I like this. You Hit the it. frog and toad. Yeah, it sounds more. So that would be like. Hit yeah. the freaking toad. <laughs> hit the freaking road. So hit the frog and toad. That would be hit like, you know, like hit, hit the ground running sort of thing. Okay. You know, like All right. Take okay, off, right? I can see that. But I don't really think that's Australian. Hit the frog. Yeah, I think that's more okay. British. Anyway, here's some funny ones from Phil EO. All right. So, swinging like a dunny door. So First of all, do you know a dunny? Do you know? A... No. Right. That's not familiar. Ryan, dunny. 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 What's, what could a dunny be? A dunny. D u w n y. A, a dumb person. Right. A so dummy? dunny uh, used to be like outhouse bathroom. Oh. oh! Swinging like a dunny door. A dunny door. It's so like, it's like constantly going to the yeah. bathroom. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. Yeah. I don't really know that one. I guess we'll find the door out. Swing okay. Open. Swinging like a dunny door. Let's try that one. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. Say it. Say it in your. Swinging you. like a dunny door. Swinging like a dunny door. Yeah. Nice. You're very British. Yeah. That's like well, we, you know, convicts. So that's right. <laughs> well, <little> Irish. <laughs> You're all, all the good people. <laughs> Swinging like a dunny door. Yeah, I like the pause as well. Swinging like a dunny door. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we're getting there. These are going to get interesting as we go along. Are. I think. This should be great. We had some oh, more yeah. ones from Phil, which was great. Phil. Stone the flaming crows. Okay. Say that one more time. Stone the flaming crows. Stone the flaming crows. Yeah, like it is like there is a bit of a British twang, I guess. You watch too much. BBC. It's okay. Say it again. Stone the flaming crows. Stone the flaming crows. Right. Nice one. Okay. Is that right? Sounds, yeah, that's, that's good. That, that's good, man. <laughs> now I've got one from. Uh, <laughs> it doesn't. Matter. Now I've got one from Kelly. Uh, okay. So uh, classic. Throw another shrimp on the Barbie. Oh my gosh. Throw a shrimp on the Barbie. Know? Throw another shrimp on the barbie. Throw another shrimp on the barbie. Nice. Is that, right. is that how you would say it? 
throw no, another shrimp on the barbecue. No, place the shrimp on the barbecue. Place the shrimp on the barbecue. Delicately <laughs> place No, no one said that. <laughs> no one would be like that. Up on the bar. Put some shrimp on the barbecue. Yeah. Yeah. Throw a shrimp on the barbie. Can throw another that? shrimp on the barbie. Nice. Yeah, it's right? good. Was it? Yeah. Since we're in that sort of territory, Barbie. Dingo ate my baby. <laughs> Can we have that one? <laughs> Dingo ate my baby. Nice. Loved it. That's not the Texas. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, all right. Try. Either way, Dingo got that baby. Okay. The Dingo is not. Okay. Me. Dingo ate my baby. Yeah. Right. I feel right at home now. Okay. Uh, Crikey. Right. Uh, that's my favorite. Can we have slightly colorful? Sure. Mm. Like this one? <laughs> you change it to arse. Right. Say okay, arse. great. Y'all say arse? Pig's ass. Arse. Arse. Pig's arse. Pig's arse. Yeah. I couldn't say bottom with an Australian twain. Pig's booty. Pig's booty. <laughs> Pig's arse. <laughs> yeah, nice. Great. So that's like, no, like, you know, someone says something and you're like, you're lying. Hey, no. pig's ass. <laughs> Gotcha. Hey, I'm a really good guitar player. Pig's arse. <laughs> you suck. Yeah. <laughs> what about Wallaby? You do it. Wallaby. Nice. Wallaby. Nice. And Brian, what did you think a wallaby was? Uh, I thought it was a large rodent. Okay. Like like a possum, but right. like on steroids. Okay. Yeah, right. I thought it was more like a water creature type thing. Like oh, a platypus. Okay. Yeah, like a platypus. Right, and we won't say what it is, guys. If you know what it is, then. Come I know on, what it is below. now. Right, but don't tell anyone. No. I'm not gonna tell it's you. a secret, because I like that people didn't know what it was. It's yeah. super secret. It's like Com- it's in a comment sp- below and tell us what you thought it was. <laughs> it's really funny. It's like in a, an old Simpsons episode, and there's like they're talking about these horribly like mutilated bodies, and then you know this guy's with this girl and they're in the car and stuff. And she's like, oh, I can't help thinking about those people. And he's like, it's probably just a wallaby. <laughs> like, let's attack those people. And you guys know what a wallaby is. Yeah. Clearly, that's not that's, that's not, not it. A wallaby could not stomp you in your mud hole. No, that's uh, <laughs> over at Walmart. Over it definitely, at Walmart. Uh, it definitely could not. All right, so um, <laughs> this is a good one. Phil, Phil and Kelly had some, uh, some crackers. So uh, <laughs> let's see. Some crackers. Some crackers. Can't say that, right. Crackers. Let's cut that out. But between us, like... Like cracking idea or crackers to us is like great. Okay, no, yeah, that's like, fine. That's fine. You keep like it. Hunky, like. grandma be true. I don't find it offensive. Yeah. No, no, I don't, I don't want to offend. Like, yeah. I don't think you're gonna offend you. No. Oh, okay. White people can't get offended. Okay. They're all. Right. They've already too offended. Crackers. <laughs> all right. So Phil had a great one. Uh, okay. Your packs are useless galas. Galoshes. Galas. Galas. Your packs useless galas. Your packs of useless galas. Nice. There wasn't an oven there, but it's good. I said oh, it yeah, okay. good. That's good. That's good. So that's like a uh, pack like, of morons. Yeah, basically, pack of morons. Your pack yeah. of useless galahs. What's a galah? Pack so a galah is like a, a parrot that we have, like a bird. Oh, yeah, it's pink. Yeah. You're useless parrots. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> makes sense. So another thing that we say all the time is because you know everyone in Australia is super relaxed, mm. very very laid back, right? <laughs> so she'll be right, mate. Okay. She'll be right, mate. She'll be right, mate. So this could cover anything. Oh, my house is on fire. Can you please? She'll, she'll be right, mate. That's all right. That's the whole, <laughs> that's the whole relaxed <laughs> atmosphere. Be that you oh, uh, just uh, have, she'll be right, mate. Have some toasty, warm smoes. Smoes. <laughs> yeah. Just throw that's a bu- shrimp on the bar. Oh, <laughs> nice. I held that one. It was a wallaby. Okay. What about this one? Up at the crack of sparrow's fart. Up at the crack of sparrow's fart. So early morning. Okay. Wow. <laughs> okay. Say up. Uh, up at the crack of sparrows fart. Up at the crack of sparrows fart. <laughs> I don't know what that was. I, I think she's offended like four different races there. I don't know, probably so. Up at the crack of sparrows fart. Nice. Okay. Fart. Uh, we've got. Fired. So that was from Matt. Fired. So that was from Maddie. So we've got heaps more from Maddie. Thanks, Maddie. Uh, Thanks. <laughs> that was great. Fair Dinkum. Yeah. Fair dinkum? Yeah. Fair dinkum? It's like, really? Fair dinkum? Yeah. Pig's eyes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I can't say the next one. That's a bit too colorful, unfortunately. Where can we see it? You can read it, but we can't say it. Is that bad? Yeah. That's interesting, because I would be like, I don't know what that means. Yeah. Well, it applies sort of in this country, too. 
Uh, I'll give it a burl. I guess it's more Scottish though. Yeah. Skip that one. Ridgy Ditch. Ridgy Ditch. Ridgy Ditch. Ridgy Ditch. Means like, um, yes, okay. Ridgy Ditch. <laughs> Did you just say okay? <laughs> No. <laughs> <laughs> Not in my country. It doesn't, it doesn't con con convey the same. It's like us saying, like, I. Yeah. I, yeah. A ridgy ditch. Ridgy ditch. Ridgy ditch. Ridgy ditch. Uh, exactly. All right, so we're, so it's really funny. We have words like, well, I mean, those, I should say that that isn't really used too, too much any, anymore. Everything nowadays seems to be super short, like a day instead of good day. Mm -hmm. Instead of how are you? How are you? Everything. Oh, yeah. G'day, oh, yeah. So everything. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So everything. Like, shark. Because no one's got time. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Even that one probably just abbreviated to today. Shark. So, so instead of Monday, we won't say Monday. Monday. Tuesday. Tuesday. Wednesday. Wednesday. Thursday. Thursday. And so. Thursday. Right. Thursday. Uh, Monday. Thursday. Another classic. Struth. 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 Yes, yeah, that would be like similar to crikey. Crikey. Struth. Crikey. Crikey. But nobody says cracky. Ostrus. <laughs> Ostrus. Yeah. Those aren't real words. It's not commonly used. We're bringing it back. Uh, We're bringing Struth back. Bringing the term spit the dummy. Spit the, the dummy. Spit the dummy. You can imagine like spit to be like dummy. angry. Yeah. 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 Right. No, I can see that. Okay. That means that means someone's angry. Now I've actually completely forgotten what this one means. So hopefully YouTube doesn't hate me with this one. I can't remember. Like from Liam Purdy, like a shag on a rock. Sounds painful. Ew. Yeah. Like a shag on a rock. Yeah. yeah. It's like something that's described as. Because shag could go either of a few ways. So yeah. It's like a shag on a rock. Yeah, it's tricky that one. You're uh, so English. You're so British when you say this. I I know I was saying this. I'm like you know. You're like a pure Australian. Like closer <laughs> to close, closer to the originators. <laughs> well, depends uh, who you talk to. I I know. Know. <laughs> not not the original Australians. <laughs> not the native Australians. But the. Uh, <laughs> the immigrants. The, the imported, the imported Australians. Gotcha. Original imports. The first imports. The, the criminals. Right. So, um, is that offensive? Dry, people say no. that and they say, hey, your country is. No, that's terrible. my heritage, you know. So. A penal I mean, not my particular heritage. That's my computer. All oh, right. Yeah. That's not my particular heritage. My family moved over. Immigrant. Right. Yeah, yeah, immigrated, yeah. So, um, so did mine, like 500 years ago. Oh, nice. Well, 200. 150. <laughs> like, makes sense. So, dry as a dead dingo's donger. Donna or Donga? Donga. Dong. 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 Ah. Silent. Mm, what does that mean? Sort of. Silent. Dead. Dry as a, as a dead dingo's dry. donga. Okay. Dry. Dry as a dead dingo's donga. Nice. Dry as a dead dingo's donga. <laughs> dry as a dead dingo's donna. <laughs> donga. 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 Donga shake. <laughs> dry as a dead dingo's donga. Nice. Right. So yeah. it's pretty dry, right? Okay. Yeah. How so is your sandwich? <laughs> Dry as a dead dingo's donga. Nice. All right. So yeah, instead of coke, instead of, instead of bottle shop, like uh, alcoholic, like shop to buy alcohol, mm -hmm. bottle low. Bottle low. Now this could be one of those things bottle like bottle yeah, low. Nice. nice. Sure. Bottle low. Let's go. I, bottle low. I, I need some bottle low right now. Yeah, and you can't. There's no bottle low in Canton because Canton is as dry as a dead, dead dingo's donga. It is. Yeah. Brilliant. Thank you. Uh, what good. that means is in our city and county, We've well, been. in our city, they don't sell alcohol in the they city. They don't sell yeah. alcohol in it's the city. illegal. Yep. It's dry as a dead dingo's donga. Nice. That's good. I like That's that. good. So tinny, right? So tinny would be like a can of beer, right? Okay. A can. Tinny. Tinny. It's not really tinny. That. tinny. But it's interesting. It's dry. It's dry. You want your it beer is. in a bottle or a tinny? <laughs> bottle sounds more manly. All right, uh, Lambros, uh, so that was from Chris Watson, sorry. Awesome. Uh, yeah, there was some colorful ones there that unfortunately we, we cannot say. <laughs> family, uh, family friendly show. <laughs> family friendly. We're PG-13. PG -13. For all the kiddos watching the Dead Dingo's Dome. All right, so Lambros had a great one. Uh, fair shake of the sauce bottle. Fair shake of the sauce bottle. Bottle? Right. Fair shake of the sauce bottle. Yep. <laughs> Ryan just saw some more colorful ones that wow. we can... <laughs> so we're a little bit... Australia is very relaxed. Ben Aitken? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're, <laughs> we're, we're a very relaxed country. And people would normally go around saying this stuff, like in restaurants, nice places. To your mom. To your mom, yeah. 
But um, oh, Meg gets, he gets stumped too much with that one. <laughs> <laughs> Your mom would stomp you. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. But anyway, so uh, we did fair shake of the sauce bottle, didn't we? Yeah. Fair shake of the sauce bottle. Yeah, so it's like, fair oh yeah, well done. Fair shake of the sauce bottle. Yeah, nice. Um, oh yeah, right. Or Australian. So, or yes. the Texas accent. Fair, fair shake of the sauce bottle. Fair shake of the sauce bottle. I don't really have a thick Australian accent, so I hope I'm doing okay. Yeah, uh, yeah. So, one from, so that was from Lambros. Mm -hmm. uh, we cannot say Ben Atkins. Sorry, Ben. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, <laughs> uh, so, Chris, Chris Frey uh, had said, could you guys please say for his, his family and friends back in Colorado? Hello, Tyler Wallabay. Hello, Tyler Wallabay. <laughs> Hello, Tyler. Wallaby. Nice. <laughs> what's, a Wallaby. Classic, what's a classic uh, Texas saying if you could say something to Tyler that you could say? Um, like, hi, Tyler. <laughs> Howdy, Tyler. Hi. What's up? <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> but wouldn't it be a bit slower? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. This part is Texas. Oh, come around here, Tyler. Some, some people are slower. Hi, Tyler. <laughs> hi, Tyler. How are you doing? Uh, How's your mama? You want some tea? How's your daddy? <laughs> good? I Thank hope good. so. Hi, <laughs> hey, Tyler. Let's go shoot some guns. <laughs> Let's go shoot some tennis. Nice. There you Nailed go. Nailed it. Yes. Yeah. All right. So, so one from, uh, so that was from Chris. Uh, so <laughs> one from Clancy. Um, some drongo just drove up me clacker. <laughs> I like that with the Yeah, best. it's really good. That's yeah. a great one, Clancy. Oh, it sounds uncomfortable. So, <laughs> either way, you're going to have a bad day. Exactly. A good thing. Like a trip to the... Yeah. Especially if you don't goodness, dry. Thank goodness Drove is up there. <laughs> Otherwise, things could get messy. It's like so, a trip to the urology. Okay, so what was it? Some drongo some, just drove up me clacker. Some drongo, drongo. Some drongo just drove up me clack, clacker? Some drongo just drove up me clacker. Some drongo just drove up me clacker. Some drongo. <laughs> Pat, so excited. Some drongo just drove up me clacker. <laughs> Are you excited about that? <laughs> I'm fired up. Yeah. All right, better. Okay. I don't know. Better. Pig's eyes. <laughs> you seem to really like that. I like I that know. one. <laughs> that one I'm going to use that one it's all very, the time. It's very British. Yeah, Is it? yeah I would say, yeah. Well, I'm not saying it right. I'm saying arse because... That's okay. Is that okay? Is that acceptable? That's fine, yeah. Uh, all right, so my friend Nicole, mm -hmm. so that was from Clancy again. My friend Nicole has said, how's it going, Shags? So that could just be like, well, actually, before that, we should do Sheila. 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 Yeah. Sheila. Look at that little Look Sheila. Look at that little yeah. Sheila over there. Isn't Sheila she a beaut? What a flaming drongo that Sheila is. Look <laughs> at those Sheilas. Sheila. Sheila. So right. Crikey, look at those Sheilas. Crikey, look at them flaming drongos. So let's go about? swim with the Shags. What about, how's it going, Shags? How's, how's it going, going Shags? Shags? Right, okay. Uh, Shags, is that like fellas? Yeah, I guess guys, yeah. Dudes? Yeah, yeah. So that was from Nicole. We've got a whole gigantic paragraph from, from Kari. Um, some, some of which are, some quite, are, some, some are quite colorful. I like that one. A yeah. Oh, yeah, right. A few roos loose in the top paddock. What does that mean? So it means like someone's um, as sharp as a, a bowling ball. Sharp as a... Bag of hammers. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. A, a few roos. Loose in the top loose paddock. in the top paddock. Nice. Oh, yeah. It was almost New Zealandy at the end. That was good. New Zealandy. Yeah. yeah. I don't like that girl. <laughs> I don't like that Sheila. She's a few roos short in the top paddock. Nice. Loose, loose. in the top paddock. Oh, okay. So, so uh, the next one, similar theme again from Curry. He's a stubby thought of, short of a six pack. He's a stubby <laughs> short of a six pack. Stubby he meaning titty. He's a stubby short of a six pack. He's a stubby short. He's a short stubby. <laughs> he's, short, six he's short and stubby. He's, oh. Would you replace that with, he's a tinny short of a six pack? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, that's good. I admitted that. Uh, oh yeah, all right. See you tomorrow, Arvo. See you tomorrow, Arvo? So Arvo meaning afternoon. See you tomorrow, Arvo. Arvo is a very popular one. Okay. Arvo. Arvo? Ar yeah, tomorrow. Arvo. Arvo. A R V O. A R V O. See you tomorrow, Arvo. Yeah. Arvo. Up the duff. Up the duff. Someone's up the duff. Up the duff. Preggers. 
Uh, I'm Pregus. not. That's another one, right? Up the death. Up the death. We've only been up the death twice. Right. When they're in there. <laughs> but when they were, there was a bun in the oven. You guys have that here, right? Yes. In the oven, yeah. Right. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Knocked up. Okay. <laughs> uh, very pleasant to say. No. Uh, I think you guys have most of these here. Stunned mullet. Yeah. No. No. I mean, oh, I don't know okay. Mullet is, but oh, yeah. right. Stunned mullet. Okay. Mullet is a haircut. That's. Oh, right. right. It's also a fish. Oh. So stunned mullet is like someone surprised. A stunned mullet. Yeah. Stunned mullet. Again, these are crazy. These you wouldn't right, like. You wouldn't talk to a normal Australian and get all of these in one oh, conversation. Oh, she was found out. She was up the duff. She was a stunned mullet. Nice. Pulling your leg. You got that one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Just pulling your leg. Yeah. Right. your chain. Yep. Ball and chain. Yeah. Your ball and chain. All right. Life. Right. Uh, Maccas. Do you guys say Maccas or Mickey D's? Mickey, Mickey D's. D's. Right. So we say Maccas. M A W C A S. Maccas. Maccas. Mackers. Mackers. Yeah. Where'd you get those uh, beef nuggets? Mackers. Mackers. Beef nuggets. Mackers. What about uh, Bogan? Bogan? Right. What's that? So, hmm, how to describe a Bogan? Someone, I guess, with a mullet, right? Mm-hmm. Wears a lot of uh, wife beaters. maybe wife beaters. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, maybe drinks a lot of tinnies all the time. Mm. Just a bit of a goofball. A red white. Yeah, sort of. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. Bogan. 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 Right? Uh, Don't go to the lake. That's where all the bogans live. Nice. Having old tinnies. Uh, instead of flip flops, we call them thongs. Thongs. Some people do that here. Yeah. yeah. Thongs. Older, older. I don't like that. Oh, well, yeah, because underwear is also so. Con- I always thought that's confusing to me. Thong, 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 thong. I call them flip flops. Yeah, nice thongs. Or flirt flirts. Uh, oh, yeah, we went over Dunny before. That's right. Dunny. Dunny. Uh, no, no, chewing the fat. Chewing the fat? Mm-hmm. Chewing the fat. What have you been doing all day? Chewing, chewing the, the fat. fat. Do you have chunder when someone chunders? <laughs> like thunder with a C at the front? No. Chunder? Oh, I mean, I'm like curious to see what you guys like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hurl, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Hurl, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Chunder. 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 Too many tinnies leads to chundering. <laughs> <laughs> what about knackered? Knackered. Tired? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Knackered. We don't ever say it, but I know it's um, uh, That doesn't mean. Snuckered means drunk. There's an awesome one from Aaron, but again, we can't super read it because it's it's colorful in what it, the terminology would be. You could say it. See here, like I would be like, I don't know what that means. Oh, great. Maybe you can just say it then. Oh, man. <laughs> well, because all of our American players would be like, is that a Macadocha? <laughs> yeah, gotcha. Yes, please. Get a pine up in ya? <laughs> Yeah. Get a pine up in yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right. So that's for Aaron. Yeah. Okay. I don't know what that, say that, know that means. That's but, okay. I'm sure someone will let you know down below. Probably uh, down under. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, Ryan Lolly has said shark. Yeah. Shark. How, do you, how do you say shark? Shark. Shark. Yeah. Shark. Shark. See, I would go shark. <laughs> Run. <laughs> Swim. Well, you'd already be dead. Yeah, by the time you can say it, you're gone. It'll be too late. Yeah. Shark. Yeah. If you're in the water. Yeah. Um, we've got a, so that was from Ryan. We have one from Aaron. Then we've got uh, some from uh, Laura. You we've little got, ripper. Nice. Is that right? You yeah. little ripper. Nice. Is that Great. Little well, punk. No, it's like you're doing a good job. Oh. Yeah, funny, isn't it? Yeah. Um, emphasis is getting good. I you saw you play the guitar, you little ripper. Nice. Ah, oh, that's good. That's that would good. go work. You're like a shredder. You little yeah. ripper. Ripper. Tracky Dax. Tracky Dax. Yeah. Tracky Dax. So like uh, sw- sweat sweatpants. Oh, okay. Tracky Dax. Chancho, I need to borrow your Tracky Dax. <laughs> Man, I love that movie so much. Yeah. Like, great yeah. film. It's the best. <laughs> Tracky Dax. Oh, very impressed. All right. Uh, no wuckers. No wuckers. Yeah. So I can say I can say this one, but people will piece it together maybe. So no wucken forties. If you change the W and oh. F around. Oh. <laughs> no worries. No yeah. worries, mate. Was it, what was it saying? Uh, wakas. No wakas. So no wakas. Short for no, no, no worries. No wakas furries. Oh, no freaking worries, mate. <laughs> yeah. I say freaking. Yeah. yeah. Or freaking. That's okay. Uh, oh, yeah. Shark with lasers. So, everyone, so Laura, uh, they say this a lot here too. I reckon. I reckon. I reckon. Yeah. I reckon so. We say that a lot. Uh, yeah, it's Texas. Y'all stole and it. This is so funny that, that <laughs> no one else thought of this, including myself. Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. Have you heard that one? Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. Right. So some, Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. Yeah. Aussie. 
<laughs> so people will chant that at like a sporting event or a concert. So it's kind of like, ole, ole, ole. Yeah, yeah, but people, yeah, but ours is simpler because we're lazy. So it'll be like, Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. There's too many syllables. Oi, oi, oi. Oh, okay. That's yeah. the response. Oi, oi, oi. Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. Oi, oi, oi. Yeah, exactly. Nice. Nailed it. Okay. <laughs> we're down to the last two. So that was from uh, Laura. And, you know, uh, you know and we say at Dallas good. Cowboys games? Right. You suck! <laughs> oh, man! <laughs> So much money. <laughs> Leave it! Biscuit! <laughs> well, maybe no one says anything because no one's there. Yeah. No, they're there. They're cricket, just, cricket. just angry. They're just sad. Angry, right. They're right. just sad. Um, just sad Texans. So from, uh, oh well, from, from so Chris had um, dead dingoes, dry than dead dingoes, donger as well. Dry than a dead dingoes, donger. So, yep. Yeah, it's donger. 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 Yeah. yeah. He spelled it wrong. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, no. It's supposed to be with an A at the end. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, I mean. Donga. That's that's how it's said. But we what's did that one What's up, Donga? Backside. No. Frontside? Yeah. <laughs> that's what I thought I just wanted yeah, to ask you. Yeah, what do they call it in, um... A wee-wee. Nah. I was thinking of a funny British saying that we could say. Wanker. <laughs> <laughs> Let's leave it at that, right? Yeah, right. Is that a bad word? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Because we watch Hot Fuzz a lot. Oh yeah. It's like wanker. Yeah. I'm like this. Okay. Don't say anymore. <laughs> Why? It's not a bad word here. <laughs> That's true. It's, it's like right. saying poop. Yeah. Poop it's face. It's the same thing as the other face. Yeah. Right. Uh, well, yeah. So that was all of them. Thanks everyone on on Facebook for writing yeah. in. That was that, that was, was great. Really good. Thank you. I've never done one of those questions where like I asked. My, all my mates back home. Oh yeah, so friends, we say mates. Mate. Come mate. We didn't say that, man, that's so obvious. Like, come yeah. Hey mate, now. good day, mate. It's what so funny, sense? like, when we were doing, when I was- Yeah, talking, mate. Yeah. Nice. Is that too much? Is that Steven it up? It should be less syllables to the point where it's just a uh, Good night, mate. mate. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, mate. Yeah. Well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> thank you. Yeah, it's going Good night, mate. <laughs> good night, mate. But, so, we've, I've never done that before. Um, you know, ask people on Facebook, so that was really cool. Yeah, that's and, awesome. Um, you know, it was so funny, like, when, when you were asking me Texas things, mm -hmm. initially, like, when you were doing it, you were, like, it's hard to think of just things, because they're so yeah. ordinary, everyday stuff, so right. it's hard to, like, think yeah. of something out of the ordering, you know? Yeah. Because well, I, don't, I don't know what's stereotypical Texan. Because we say stuff all the time, we don't think, yeah. oh my gosh, you, did you just say that? Yeah, exactly. It's because we hear it all the time. Yeah, so it's more, so, so basically how it started is we were, we were just talking throughout the day, and then someone would say something mm -hmm. that the other person had never heard, and then we'd be like, what's that? And then that's what's what this donga? Yeah, right, yeah. Well, mm -hmm. I, a lot of those sayings we don't use all the time, but... It's not a, yeah. No. Yeah, not if you came, if you came to Australia and used more of the, if you used a lot of those terms, I think people would, even a few people would be like, what are you, what? What's, what's wrong with you? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah, you've had too many tinnies. Too many tinnies. Too many tinnies. But, anyway, that's it. I've been Pat. I've been Ryan. And I've been Angela. And we're over in RNA Music over in Kenton, Texas. Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Woo! See you again. Bye. Bye.